hello everyone and welcome back to my channel in today's tutorial we'll learn how to train detectron 2 on a custom data set we will be covering custom instance segmentation and custom object detection this tutorial will be split into two parts this is the first part in which we will develop a custom data set and in second part we will train detectron 2 on this custom data set so let's get started First of all, we will need to download some images from Google for annotations. For that, let's start by installing a module by command pip install minus minus upgrade simple underscore image underscore download. Once the installation is done without any errors, let's create an empty Python script called image underscore downloader dot py. Open this script and import simple image download initialize it now we need to mention the keywords against which we want to search and download the images i would be doing license plate detection for this tutorial so let's start searching for cars with license plate and vehicles with license plate and i want to limit the number of images to 50 for each keyword let's save this script and run it a new folder called simple underscore images will be created and against each keyword that we just mentioned the images will be downloaded in a subfolder all the images are downloaded i'm gonna merge all the images in a single folder called train We might need to perform manual cleaning to remove undesired or duplicate images. I also have separated 5 images in the test folder and now we can remove the simple underscore images folder which is empty. Now the images are ready for the annotations. For annotating the data, we will be installing label me by using the command pip install label me. Once the installation is done, run the tool by typing command label me and hit enter. You will see this user interface. Click on open dir and open our train folder. You would see the images that we previously downloaded. Now click on create polygons and draw a segmentation mask around the object you are interested in. This should be as accurate as possible. Luckily I have chosen an object that is rectangular in shape so it's relatively easy for me to annotate. Assign the label to the annotation and click on save. This will save a JSON file with the same name as the image. Hit next and repeat the process. If there are multiple objects within the image, draw polygons on all the objects. This might take a while. I will get back to you when all the images in the train and test folder are done. Finally, the annotation is complete. You should have one JSON file against each image in train and test split. Now we need to convert the annotations in the format that Detectron2 understands. For that we will use this tool called label me to coco which is developed by Tony607. Let's open this script as raw and select all the text and copy it. Now create an empty python script called label me to coco.py and open it in the text editor paste the code and save the file now go back to anaconda prompt and run the script give path to the train folder which contains all the images and json files and then output file name that is train.json this will create a single annotation file called train.json do the same for the test split as well and finally you should have train.json test.json as well as train and test images folders. Our dataset is ready for custom Detectron 2 training for instance segmentation and object detection. And I will see you in part 2.